What's up guys, Nukin here, and I am going to be doing a playthrough of the first Mythic event uh, pretty shortly, but let's kind of review this forum post in case you guys missed it. So on the forums, this was here, and it's talking about what Mythic events are, and it's they're, they're, they're saying, I'm basically going to summarize this up for everyone. They're saying that it's a new type of event that was requested by everyone. Yes, I was requesting a lot. <laughs> I was bothering the devs every few weeks. And you can replay the legendary events and it's sort of like a elder max level content type of thing. And it says here that mythic events share the same name and theme of their legendary uh, cousins but have altered content. So the first one is the BB-8 Pieces and Plans. Uh, we just had that recently, and then it's it's going live now. And then after you beat that, I guess you can <laughs> you could do that. Um, you can do that next. I just spit ill. Okay. Uh, then there's three tiers to the Mythic events, and tier one is the same. Okay. And then it has all the cutscenes. And then tier two, you can do uh, any sort of team. So the first tier, you'll you'll use the first order, uh, basically what you use to do the event. Tier two, you can use any team that you want. And then tier three, you're forced to use the resistance or whatever you fought against in tier one. And it's supposed to be very difficult. So let's kind of hop right in and uh, see what it's all about. All right, so let's look at the rewards that we have here. So we have credits and looks like mods. We have offense in the first two tiers and some offense and speed mods. Oh, it looks like there's speed mods in all the places, but they're purple, so that's good. And then a decent amount of credits. So let's, all right, you know, that's pretty good. Let's jump into some gameplay now. So we'll have to start off with tier one. Uh, we're forced to use the first order. This shouldn't be too bad. My first order team is pretty strong. The soccer ball himself. <laughs> all right. Here we go. So I think tier one's gonna be pretty easy, so we're gonna put it on auto. See what we can do here. Yeah, pretty easy. Um, I'm assuming if it's harder um, for you and you don't have a good first order team, you probably want to take out the damage dealers and heroes that are annoying. So. BB-8 is kind of annoying. Ray does a lot of damage, so I'd probably take out them. Anyways, um, it looks like they're about as strong as the legendary event, maybe a tad stronger. Okay, so this is tier one, and it's the same units too. So tier one, you use first order, and then I think tier two, you can use anyone. So we'll try a different team just for fun. See what we got here. Ooh, has secondary speed on it. So that's nice. All right. So tier two. Yeah, we can use anyone. So let's use um, let's use a empire team. All right. Let's see how the empire does against the resistance. Uh, keep in mind my Empire team is pretty strong as well. Like they're doing even a better job than the First Order. <laughs> Alright, so Tier 2 is... Looks like they're about as strong, maybe a tad stronger than Tier 1. Um, probably should have used First Order actually to compare the difficulty. But Tier 2 doesn't seem too difficult either. It looks like if you have kind of a gear 11 wad with some synergy and average mods, you should be doing all right for the first two tiers. Ooh, gold mod. 
no secondary speed. All right, that's tier two. All right, so now we're gonna do tier three. Uh, let's see, we are required to do resistance. All right, so let's try out this squad. All right, here we go. From what I was told, it's difficult. Okay, so they're taking their turns first. Uh-oh. A lot of turns, actually. Okay, we get to go. Let's stealth everyone. Do a basic there. Haunt. And let's dispel that. And stun him. Darn, didn't stun. Poe's taking some damage. Ooh, okay. Well, he died. <laughs> let's try one more time. All right. We might, might need to try this a few times, actually. All right, round two. Hopefully no one dies. So Finn, Finn's stunned again. Finn's taking some damage. Let's stealth everyone. I think the key is to not get stunned maybe in the first time. Um, let's dispel that. Try and stun Kylo. Taunt up. Start getting some exposes down. Get one over here. Let's do an AoE. Let's stealth. Another taunt. All right, now we're rolling. Maybe the first time was a little bit uh, lucky for them. I don't know. Looks like we got this now. Just gotta keep the exposes rolling. Let's um, stun this guy, our girl, and more AOE. More expose. Get an expose over here. All right, here we go. Illuminated destiny. First order. First order is about to get whooped. <laughs> All right, we're like Super Saiyan mode now. Here we go. Okay, more expose, and let's do a heal for him, and stealth, and I think we could just pretty much do auto for the rest, and we got it. So that was kind of difficult. Um, maybe I got lucky the second time here. Um, I think R2 is important. That stealth uh, is helpful. BB-8 is required. Definitely want... De you definitely need a resistance uh, Zeta. For sure. <laughs> On uh, Finn. Protection arrow. And a defense arrow. They both have secondary speed. You know what? Let's upgrade... Let's upgrade the mods that we got. Let's go over here. Mods that so we were given these mods here. Let's see how high this goes. Nine. All right. I'll never use a defensive arrow, but curious. 15. Ugh, why couldn't you be on a triangle? <laughs> Maybe I'll try and use that. All right, and then what were, what were, I don't remember what else we got from that. It was offense, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that one. All right, and here we go. 
Eight. Respectable, I guess. All right, well, that was the mythic event for the pieces and plans. So they're going to be doing more of these for all the legendary events. Uh, hopefully you guys were able to do a few tiers. The third one seems kind of hard. Uh, good luck with that one. Extremely challenging, huh? Uh, if you need any help modding these guys, drop a comment below or hit me up on Discord. Hope you enjoyed the playthrough. Uh, it was kind of short. But uh, I look forward to doing more of these. I think they're fun. I like to, I've been asking the devs and bothering them to bring the legendary events for a while now. So I'm happy they're here. All right. Cheers, guys.